neighbors. They've been coming in all day today to say bye to me before we leave. Our overall goal um, for our group is to minimize our environmental impact on the communities that we're in. We had previously talked with Evanston. We knew about their dedication to green building and sustainable building. The goal was to have this store generate more energy than it uses. decided to go with solar as our primary uh, renewable energy source for this project and we're able to get enough on here through the design of the building to actually be more than what we would need to use. So we will, at points during the year, actually feed electricity back into the grid. much forward to seeing my customers. <laughs> coming out my it's the first of its kind uh, in the world to operate this way. That also that we're going to be so open to sharing what we learn with other people in the industry so that it's not the only one that ever gets built. Um, but the things that we're going to learn from this project are, are so important to the future of our company and the future of our planet. It's been quite a journey. This was a very complicated project. There are 4.2 million retail stores in this country. So this store is one in two million. You actually have better odds of becoming a billionaire than you do of walking into a net zero energy retail store. And I'm proud to say that Walgreens has one of them.